Welcome to FS17 on the Squirrel Farms map. Today we will be doing a fall camping trip with a homeowner series. We'll be heading over to the campground, setting up camp, and then we'll be having some fun on the dirt track. We will be using the 2018 GMC 2500 HD tall hour fifth wheel camper trailer, and we will be using the 2018 F-150 with the enclosed trailer to transport a few off-road toys over as well. And the owner of the campgrounds just purchased a brand off-road toy and he will be letting us use it for a few hours today which is going to be pretty exciting let's hop here in the brand new GMC this will be one of our first times taking it with a brand new toy hauler as well this is the 2500 HD with a Duramax and also the all-terrain package and then you guys can see uh, we just previously got the plow mount installed on this for the snow plowing season which is just around the corner this will more than likely be our last fall camping video here of the year as well which is pretty exciting and I can't wait to do some snow camping that is going to be awesome let's get backed up here to this trailer now kind of leaving this uh, area is going to be a bit tight I will have to say it looks like we are just out there you guys can see it's very close to the house and uh, we got to be as careful as we can so we us kind of slowly pull forward here let's see if we can get a little bit further away from the building as we kind of make a sharp turn here. It's a bit tricky, but that is okay. I really do kind of like how it's parked up. So here with the homeowner series, we have been doing a lot of cool things lately around the house, but today is our first time going camping with this series. This is a pretty exciting thing, and I definitely want to do this more with this series as well. It's pretty realistic. We already have the house set up and everything like that. I hope all of you guys are having a great day today. Let me know how it is down below here in the comments. My day is going good so far, and I hope yours is too. This is our first time going camping in a very, very long time. A few months, I will have to say. We've been so busy doing so many different types of videos. We just haven't gone to around to going camping, but now uh, we got a few days here to go camping. Uh, I took a few days off work to do this, so we'll have some fun here, and uh, after this we'll kind of put all these toys away and uh, wait until we do some snow camping. Now this 2500 all-terrain really tells this trailer like it's nothing. You guys can see it's a pretty big toy hauler. It's just around 45, 50 feet, and it's a triax. So you guys can see it's just so, so long. But uh, all the new trucks really do a great job. So I think we'll set up camp, and then we'll go back, get the other ones. And we might have to put uh, off-road toy, probably our small ATV in it. Uh, the better the F-150. We might have to do that. Wouldn't be that bad and would be actually pretty awesome at the same time. Take a look at this, guys. This really does a great job towing. And a few of these spots here at the campgrounds have also opened up because of a lot of people taking their campers back. But some people will leave them here all uh, season long, which is very nice. We can't do anything now uh, out with our jet skis or the boat. It's just too late in the season, and the water is pretty cold. So we are only out here to have fun on the dirt track. And that actually looks pretty good right about there. So we'll drop this. We'll get it disconnected. That way the toy hauler sits level and we'll park the truck right in front like that. So that looks pretty awesome. We'll hop out of this and switch back over here to the 2018 F-150. Now, over here in the garage, we actually were able to fit all of our cars inside. Now, that is pretty exciting, I will have to say. I got lots of requests to move the Ferrari over. I did, and it is actually working out pretty nice. And like I've touched upon, this homeowner series is an incredible series. I definitely do plan on bringing this over to the new FS19 as well. And that's coming out within a few weeks as well. So we are just so close to the brand new game and I can't wait for it we'll drop the ramp down here and let's see if we can put both toys on the inside up here now this is a 2018 F-150 XLT with a 5.0 liter V8 that's my, uh, probably my favorite engine of all time yeah, that Ford has made they are just awesome the 6.4 liter V8 as well and the first gen Raptor is also pretty cool maybe just maybe we might gotta get a first gen Raptor those things are amazing they do sound pretty cool and they are awesome on the off-road so this truly should be able to fit both of them we are taking that and the brand new Polaris this will be our first time at the dirt track with it you guys can see this is awesome it's very shiny we haven't taken that off-road but today is that day this camping trip is going to be quite a bit of fun and we probably should have put that one first uh 
to make the weight distribution a little bit better but it looks like it's just over the axle so we should be fine there like I have touched upon, we've been so busy with so many different things that we actually haven't done a camping video. So it's nice to be back here going out, uh, setting up our campsite and just having some fun. And this winter will also be a very interesting winter. Uh, from the looks of it, we are going to be getting a lot of snow. But the house is all locked up there, garage is closed, and uh, the doors are locked. And now we are just ready to go have some fun for the rest of this weekend. And this F-150 does have ramps. Uh, we can put things in the bed, but it looks like we don't have to today. We can easily take an hour dirt bike. Uh, that might have been a good decision for us, but on the inside of this F-150 is amazing. I've sat in a few F-150s in real life, the brand new 2018s, and they look just like this. So it's nice to have that. And I am using a controller to help out with the camera movements and the handling, and it's a lot easier to use the controller as well. But this is awesome on the inside. Once we do get the campsite set up, we'll have some fun here with our off-road toys and then we will be having some fun with the owner's new off-road toy. It's a brand new Ram custom off-road truck and the brakes on this truck, wow, just sliding right through there. Let's kind of see. I believe that we do not have the LED lights on this. That's actually on the Lariat in above, so we don't have the LED daytimes, but I mean, this is one awesome truck and there it is, guys. I can't wait to take that out. That's going to be exciting and a brand new uh, dirt on the track as well. Take a look at that. We'll have to do a full walk around of that. He is giving us the keys for a few hours. I did call him up and uh, he said he would let us. That's pretty awesome. And we do take care of his campgrounds as well. So it's nice of him to do that. And I think for this, we're just going to park this right on. Actually, uh, there's really no need uh, to park on the grass. We'll just take up this one over here. Like I've touched upon, there isn't much people coming around. Uh, this time so we'll be fine if someone needs this spot we could easily kind of give it back up but we'll get that door closed and uh, we'll get the back gate opened up you guys can see we are just about already here with the campground it's pretty much all set up we'll come over here put down that jack and we'll put down the jack over here this is just to stabilize it as well we'll put down the extra jack over there and it does sit a little bit higher that's because uh, we had to jack it up here for the truck i really wish we could have lowered it but it looks like we can you guys can see the fifth wheel back there but now it's time let's go have some fun here with our toys and then we'll have fun with his now this is a brand new player, so I actually featured this in a Forza Horizon 4 video as well. It looks like a very similar model to that. You guys can see it's the RZR 1000 Polaris. This thing will be a quite a bit of fun. Our first time here on the dirt track. Let's see if we can get some air. Let's just kind of see what's going to happen. You guys can see getting some air and already doing a barrel roll, so that's not too realistic. I really wish that uh, we could get air like it would in real life, but we'll have some fun here, you guys. And so, whoa, take a look at that. Pretty sharp turn there tire goes in and we get a uh, twist around just a little bit now you guys can see this is an awesome track I definitely do plan on building a map in FS19 probably during the summertime that would be a pretty awesome thing to do and you guys can see just cruising along here really really just pushing the player so we'll get some air not too much air that's actually a really good amount of air this one isn't really a bump it's just a pile of dirt that really is a bit dangerous to go over but you guys can see brand new players we are uh, just driving this like uh, it's in an amazing machine though the way we are driving it really pushing it to its limits in some uh, corners you guys can see just back and forth we'll get some air take a look at that air and right after that we are getting another on barrel rolling coming back on all four wheels now that I will have to say is pretty exciting usually that doesn't happen but that's okay getting some air there and just really enjoying this we do have a little visor as well to help with the wind but we do have a full row cage on this which is I, I would say a very safe off-road vehicle compared to an ATV but wow this is our last pass here with this I mean a lot of fun this uh, Polaris is and we'll get over this a little bit of air there but what I've noticed is the front end just likes to know nosedive on us and usually you could uh, keep in the gas and it wouldn't do that so let me know if there is a way to prevent that here in FS17 but that's pretty much it here for that and I definitely am looking into an interior here for the 
fifth wheel toy hauler that would be a pretty cool thing as well we'll get this unloaded now there's a lot of different types of videos coming out this week including uh, some awesome things with uh, the landscaping crew probably the heavy rescue crew and uh, even the construction crew so there's lots of things coming and hope you guys are excited for it. we actually did pretty good there on that one that wasn't that bad and uh, let's see how we do here whoa the back and this is a rear wheel drive it's just so much fun getting the back uh, slotting out on your eye that's a lot of fun uh, in general especially with uh, sport cars that do have quite a bit of power and I do have some real-life videos coming as well within the coming weeks and I definitely have a video coming with a Subaru as well you guys can see really just having a lot of fun we'll do one more lap here with this we'll get some air take a look at that air and coming back on all four wheels uh, some parts of my videos aren't going to be as realistic because of how the game reacts but I can't wait for FS19 with the new graphics, new equipment that is coming to the game. It's just so awesome. I can't wait to do a video showcasing the finalized list of all the equipment. I will definitely be doing that. But we'll do one more lap with this and then we'll get the keys to that off-road truck. It's going to be a lot of fun. You guys can see actually pretty cool. Getting quite a bit of air and the camera's going crazy. But finally we have come up here on all four wheels so i think that right there is where we're we'll probably today that way we are safe we don't get ourselves hurt but here it is guys this is called a ram runner this thing is incredible very very wide tires take a look this suspension take a look this front bumper that thing looks awesome there and this thing you guys can see wide tires a little bit lower in the front and back but we'll come over here and he said just to kind of get them out of uh, the side door area so the side door and we got the keys yep they were right there on the window so let's come over here get the keys have some fun in this and I can't wait to do it this is actually something he'll be renting out to people who come over to his campgrounds but for us since we uh, mow since we are coming here so much uh, he just gave us the keys to this now this you can't really get too much speed awesome wheelie though and this is just to kind of have some fun and uh, to take like on some off-road trails mainly but let me know should we buy this for the homeowner series should we we do have a little bit of money saved up and uh, we could definitely uh, think about purchasing this we'll only do a nice one lap here in this usually when it's another person's vehicle I don't like to damage it push it to the limits and we'll avoid these jumps just because it's a bit tricky but we'll probably leave this right about here for him he'll get it cleaned up and uh, he'll probably uh, bring it back to his garage over there and he said he brought it out just for us and that was pretty nice of him but you guys can see pretty exciting day here at the campgrounds we had quite a bit of fun with a brand new Polaris this ATV the uh, all train GMC you guys can see we got the plow mount on it wait for some snow plowing just maybe we might have to put a plow on this uh, half ton usually uh, half ton trucks don't see plows especially for commercial use but maybe just maybe we might have to put one there on it but that will be it here for today's camping video we'll kind of head our way here on the inside of the uh, toy hauler but thanks for watching have a great day and subscribe for more